What up guys? Do I look tired? Cause I feel tired. Ya girl is tired. I've had a long week. I started off the week with being sick. I took a kickboxing class last night. I don't know why I did that. I guess I felt like I wanted to die. But it's all good because I am packing. I am going to Memphis. So what's happening in Memphis? I am in Toastmasters. I decided to enter the evaluation contest first place which is awesome so now I get to go practice my talent even more and challenge myself even more in front of all of the first place winners for this division is it the division Toastmasters division I think it's the division. Oh, but I want to show you guys some of the things I'm packing. As you guys know, I enjoy LuLaRoe. I am deciding to take some of my LuLaRoe pieces with me, and I'm pretty happy about these, so I'm going to show them to you. This is going to be my contest dress. My lighting is super dark throughout my entire house. I know I should really get some camera lighting happening maybe I'll do that soon but anyway you guys might think this dress is black it's actually navy but it's navy and coral and it's got these light blue and bright yellow little prints in them it's adorable so this is the Amelia dress I'm taking it with me it is my speech contest dress and my dinner my first dinner dress. I love Amelia so much that I decided to get another one. This is actually, well, I actually owned this Amelia first. If we're counting who came into my life first, it was this one. My first Amelia love. But this one has a black background and it's got kind of like an orange burgundy and orange gold, like a bunch of like different teal colors throughout it. And it's shiny. Oh, something cool about the Amelia, they have pockets. So this dress I'm gonna wear on day two. I have a second dinner and I'm going to wear this dress to the second dinner, like I just said. Amelia, Amelia. So packing's going great. Oh, I have something to show you. This, if I do another favorites video, this is what favorites are about. I don't know what this is called. It doesn't matter what it's called. It just matters what it does. So this is where I've been hanging all of my leggings. I think it's called a scarf hanger. So I'm gonna pick out some of these and throw them in the suitcase. Memphis! We're in Memphis. This is the hotel. That's what I look like after five hours in a car. This is the room. Nice room. Excited about this coffee pot. Bath area, or sink area. Closet. Bathroom. And that's the room. And we have unpacked and we're pretty much settled into the hotel. And yes, I'm wearing sunglasses for you guys because five hours in a car, that's why. Raise your hand if you have ever went somewhere and realized that you forgot to pack something. So I forgot to pack makeup and I really want that. So now that we're settled into the hotel, we are gonna go find a place to eat food. We found like a burger joint online, so we're gonna try that out. And then we're gonna go find some makeup and other things that we forgot to pack. And if you guys can see Josh in the background, he is not going to the Toastmasters meetings with me. So he is setting up his PS4, which is kind of genius if you think about it. But yeah, that's what we're doing right now. So see you guys soon. Bye. 
Today we had an exciting day. Josh and I went to the Memphis Zoo, which is an enormous zoo. They have this Ripley's Believe It or Not sculptures throughout the zoo. So it wasn't just the animals. You had to look at all these cool sculptures too. So that was really exciting. My first time to the Memphis Zoo, amazing. And if you can't tell, I just got back from the Toastmasters evaluation competition. Got my Amelia dress on, rocking the Amelia. And guess what happened at the competition? Third place. This was amazing. Everybody there tonight were the first place winners of their area or their division. So the district contest was amazing. Getting to compete against all of the other winners. I feel like in Toastmasters, you learn something every time you go to a meeting, including the conference. I feel like I learned a lot. All of the contestants tonight were women. I don't know if this is true, but someone told me that's never happened before. That just makes me even more proud to win third place against all of these amazing women. I mentioned at the beginning of the video that I went to a kickboxing class. I'm not injured or anything. It's just a muscle in my leg that I haven't really worked out in a long time. So the middle of my calf has been killing me. And when we went to the zoo today, walking around all day long, it, it didn't make it feel any better. So coming back to the hotel after the competition, Josh had a little gift waiting for me. A bath bomb. I've never had a bath bomb, so this is going to be really fun for me. A black amber bath fizzer with a surprise inside. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to chill out. I'm going to use my bath bomb and relax and take care of my sore leg. I'm back home. If you're wondering what this mess is behind me, this, as we all know, is what it looks like when you come home from a road trip or just being away from your home for a few days. For some reason, Josh and I decided to throw all of our clothes onto the bed, even though they're probably all dirty and need to be washed. But yeah, that's the truth. That's what this looks like. But just a quick recap of yesterday, because I didn't film yesterday, Josh and I went to the Gibson Guitar Factory in Memphis and took the tour and there's no cameras allowed, no filming, no pictures or anything. But that tour was amazing. If you like guitars, if you're interested in how they make guitars or put them together, I definitely recommend that place because it was so cool. And then Memphis was doing a food truck festival. You get really, really stuffed and then you don't have to worry about eating for a long time afterwards. That's what I learned from going to the food truck festival. Also, it's been a while since I've done a shout out to my friend's t-shirt company, but I wore this shirt, Life is Better in the Ozarks, and I wore this to the guitar factory, and then I wore this to the food truck competition. Well, I wore it. This was the shirt I wore yesterday. I wore the shirt all day. This is my favorite shirt by them, and I wanted to give them a shout out because not only because I haven't done it in a while and I just really like these t-shirts because they're super soft, but everyone loved this shirt in Memphis. People kept coming up to me and commenting on it and I get to see like, oh yeah, I'm from the Ozarks and it was just fun. So this is the shirt I wore yesterday and I'm really happy about it. Also, sometimes when you're on vacation, I mean, it was for Toastmasters, but it's still a vacation. Time gets away from you, so we skipped the second Toastmasters dinner, which was fine because my part of the competition was over, and so I didn't really feel like I missed anything. That's why you're not going to see a picture of me in my second Amelia dress, is because I did not wear it. That covers the entire trip. We're back home now, and the plan is to relax, to probably take a hot shower, and to eventually get to the pile of laundry behind me. But that is very helpful to because she trains very well. Because she likes earrings right there. Oh, yeah. Can I find some more? He's 19. 